Hi Gemini, welcome to your Heart's Truth reading for August 15th through September 14th. Everything you need to know about this reading is in the description box below. If this is about you and another person, this could resonate with theirs or your moon rising or Venus sign. Alright, Gemini, Heart's Truth. Nine of Wands, Justice, that could be Libra. Four of Wands, Death, that could be Scorpio. Knight of Swords, I read that as Aquarius. Three of Pentacles, Page of Swords, all right. Uh-oh, sounded like one of them fell behind there. So we've got two fours, so two, three, four, okay, interesting, all right, Gemini, did it really fall down, oh shucks, I think I had a, okay, card fell down there, all right, so are you, are you feeling like you're being treated unfairly here, or is, is everything going to be okay, that sort of thing, is this justice about? Wheel of Fortune. Okay. What's this death card about? Because you're worried. There's worry here. There's there's not. There's just a, a real focus on an issue for you. What's this death card about, Gemini? Seven of Pentacles. This four of Wands. Gemini four of Wands. Nine of Cups. Okay. Hmm. You're thinking of ending, um, thinking of ending something, and you're. The thing is, it's already ended. If you're thinking if something's going to end or if it's going to work out, it's already ended and it's going to stay ended. And this is about you um, taking stock of where you've been and kind of just giving it a minute. Because I think you, you're still processing or working on accepting the fact that um, it's ended and it's, it's not just a, a rough patch with this job or with this whatever. You're, it's, the interest is lost for you. You're not, it's, it's something that you're having to work to keep the enthusiasm for or the connection for or... Um, it's, it's, the cost is becoming greater than the payoff. What's this Knight of Swords for Gemini? Okay, I was going to pull one, but there's two. Justice and two of Pentacles. Hmm. It's this Page of Swords. Hermit. Okay. All right. It's this Three of Pentacles. So the thing is, I think you're wanting things to happen in a much quicker time frame. Eight of Wands right there for the Three of Pentacles. You're, but you are not able to have the final say. Like perhaps this is in deliberations elsewhere because you're wanting this to get handled so that you can. Um, it's almost like you want to be told the ending. You don't want to have to wait. So perhaps this isn't about you needing to accept that it's over. It's that you're waiting to hear the decision and it's keeping you from feeling settled and happy because, you know, you feel like your happiness or your future is kind of hanging on a decision that's going to be coming. And you would really like for it to be just like the decision comes in and boom, I'm out of here. I get to go do what I want and I get to... Um, I get to adjust to a new environment. I get to figure things out on my own. There's forward movement. My, I get my life back. But it is about you um, planning for your move. It's not going to happen yet. It's, hap it's going to happen, but now is the planning time. The movement or the move and the change is at a later time. But for this time period, for this reading, your job right now is to plan. You're in limbo and you're going to have to wait for the decision. And it's, it's not about finding, or it's not about it happening. 
it's about you planning for what you want because this it's like this the decision's been made but you're not free to go yet it's coming and you'll find out soon enough but for some reason you're not able to um, move out or move on yet hmm perhaps it's money perhaps it's like you're not able to yet there's money involved there's um juggling child care or other things but uh is this you wanting to give someone a second chance but you've got your guard up so it might not be possible or did you give someone a second chance and you're like you know what this was a bad idea i shouldn't have done this shouldn't have moved back in now i feel stuck here i'm not gonna have enough money to move out until next month that sort of thing because we've got you it's like waiting on a decision regretting a decision wanting to backtrack wanting to be able to just get gone but you're having to wait and it, it hinges on um it feels like a third party telling you what's what hmm. okay. i'll tell you what though it's going to turn out better than you expected. So you're thinking that if I could just this and that, then I'll be okay. It's actually going to be better than that. Whatever you're waiting for is going to be, um, and I don't know, it's funny. I don't know if it's in terms of money. I don't think it's in money. I think the situation is going to turn out better than you expected. It's going to, you're just wanting the bear. Like if I could just be, get the keys back or if I could just get that, you might be surprised to hear someone say, Hey, you know what? I'll move. You don't have to, or, Oh, you actually might be getting a raise in three months, so stick around. It's going to be unexpected good news. Better than you expected. Just saying. Might make up for all of the her that you're feeling right now, Gemini. <laughs> it's like, you know what it is? It'll turn out better than expected, and then it'll give you choice. Because right now you feel like, oh, if I could just, uh, because of the way things are. Something's going to happen to balance things out. we got justice twice here. Balance things out. And then it'll be more of a choice what you decide. To, there won't be that fervor to just, Arr! it'll be more like, oh, well, maybe I, I want to do this now, or maybe I want to do that. But whatever you were running towards isn't the only option anymore. Do this one. So what if Gemini is dealing with a person? Now, if you don't want to deal with the romantic side of this, um, or the social or person side of this, just fast forward. But I'm going to take a look if there's a person involved here. Because this feels kind of like a, well, it feels like a relationship, honestly. But it could be a job. It feels like a relationship. But if you don't want to know any more specifics, go ahead and get going. Uh, fast forward, I mean. That's for Gemini person. Five of Pentacles. Four of Cups. Okay, I could see why then. Because you got somebody uh, quite possibly wanting the ending also, and they're giving you a silent treatment. They're not communicating with you. They're holding grudges. They're withdrawing. So you're just like, oh, now I'm stuck here with somebody that's playing mind games. You're actually going to, I don't know how, but you're going to be pleasantly surprised by uh, the outcome here. You just have to wait for the, you're in a holding pattern for at least until the um, middle of September. Yeah, okay. Last week of September is when it's just going to be what you wanted. You've got your sights set on something, but you're like, well, I got to wait for this to come in. That's not going to happen. It actually is. It's closer than you think. So whatever you've been wishing for, that's happening outside of four weeks. Not more than um, six weeks or two months though, but I think you might be pleasantly surprised five or six weeks. Gemini. So watching and waiting is the name of the game here. Watching and waiting. Isn't that fun, right? How many of us are doing that these days? Page of swords twice. Bide your time, make a plan, get yourself ready. Assume that you'll be in a position to pursue what you want. Not that you'll get what you want, but you'll be in a position. How, what, would that, what would the plan for that look like? That's what this is saying. Page of swords. <clears throat> and don't tell anybody this is this is private to you you're not communicating well yeah this is what i'm gonna do no you're not you're gonna keep that quiet you're gonna write it down but you're not gonna tell anybody the time will come just waiting right now That's 
moving forward, get, get ready for positive change. Boom. <laughs> I'm going to spin my chair around. <laughs> Moving forward. I like that polar bear. Yeah. Moving forward. Get ready for positive change. We got this. So the planning time. Yep. Get ready. Get yourself ready. One, two, three. Yeah, I did that. Okay. I think this is someone that is looking at a connection that ran its course or a job that ran its course or a roommate situation, whatever, and you're wanting to go it alone. You're wanting to um, move on to, it doesn't feel like somebody else. I mean, it could, but you're just wanting to kind of break free and you can't yet, but you will. That's good. Four of swords on its side, and this is temperance on its side. Aha. Uh -huh. So you're not able to have any peace, rest, or reprieve right now because things are so chaotic and out of whack, and you've got someone probably playing mind games with the withdrawal and the stubborn and not talking and holding on to grudges and not communicating, and you're just like, you know what, this is, I'm out of here. I don't, uh-uh. My issue with this is bigger than you, like not me. I'm saying you as Gemini would be thinking, you know what, you're looking at this person that's just like, that's just kind of how they're behaving. And you're like, yeah, it's not just behavior to me. This is a huge deal to me because you're showing me who you are. I don't think you understand the magnitude of how you're behaving towards me. I don't put up with that and I'm not sticking around if I don't have to. So I think this person is just kind of being, honestly, it's, how they're behaving, I don't think they realize the impact it's having on you. I think this is a lot bigger. I think this might be reminiscent of how, um, I, I just feel like it's a bigger issue for you. It's a lot more weighted for you than it is for the person. And I just, I, that's probably why you're like, it's so not fair. What they're doing to me is just so not fair. And I just, I want comeuppance. I want things to be balanced and right. And I want to feel happy again in my own area, in my own space. I want joy. Could be talking about being confined at home, right? But get ready, make your plans because your escape is coming. Your movement forward is coming. Things are wonky and chaotic right now. There's not much rest or reprieve. A lot of anxiety, thinking about things. We're all feeling it. All right. Gemini, I hope this was helpful. Um, you hang in there. It's coming. Much love to you. And I hope to see... Oh, wait a minute. Two pages. Two fours. Three fours. Hold on a minute. All right. So, we yeah, we've got the... we got the disquiet and the journey is at hand. Right now, your job is um, to contemplate and plan and surveil, but we've got a journey at hand soon and we've got disquiet and dis dis restlessness. Okay, now, Gemini, much love to you. <laughs> Hope to see you in the next reading. Um, you take care, you hang in there. It's, it's coming. All right.